moved a little. And to see anybody that looked like me, we had to come downtown. And that would happen usually on a Saturday or a Sunday. My parents were married at, at Union United. Uh, I was christened, and then we moved uh, to the South Shore. And when my, it was time for my children to be christened, they were christened at Union United. I teach Sunday school, I'm the Sunday school superintendent, and I teach the children love. We need love, we need to be, our motto is be kind one to another, tender-hearted, forgiving one another, and this is what I continue to teach you because the church has to continue, and if you don't show love, and you keep your faith, it's not going to work. So, so it, it's like um, a rock here, and you can always come back, and the rock is still there. And the people, the ones that have not gone, are still just as happy with you. Yes. It's a blessing. Yeah, yeah. that's great. Yeah. The community, in the church community, was a neighborhood watch, which means that uh, we couldn't get away with anything in the community at all because we not only had our parents, uh, our parents would tell us not to do, but we had the neighbors and the people from the community who would say, are you supposed to be there? Does your mother know that you're here? And so there was always a protection, no matter where we went in the community, and it kind of kept us grounded and kept us away from getting into a lot of trouble because we knew that any, anywhere we went, somebody lived in that area that went to this church. Uh, growing up, Ralph, you would remember, we did not have any policemen, white, uh, black policemen, oh, yes. or yes. black uh, detectives, firemen, firemen even cashiers at the restaurants. Uh, no one worked in a bank. Uh, all these things have changed. It has taken people. I know that Reverend S was very instrumental mm -hmm. in, in, in speaking to yeah. uh, the heads. Uh, and getting these things done. Mm -hmm. And so now we will have youngsters who will profit from this. Mm -hmm. uh, when a church can um, go out into the community and speak out against the injustices that, that they see people encounter in the community or people from the church, that is important. Because I've come from a community where the church has always spoken out spoken out against the government if they're not doing anything right, they're not afraid to do that. And when I came to Union, I saw that, that this was done. 